Hey, y'all. Holy Spirit, you are welcome here. Hi, ancestors, you are welcome here. Hey, y'all. So we're going to do one more reading tonight. All right. It's one after one in the in early rising. So listen. <laughs> Um, I got some, some looks done, taking care of business, you know what I'm saying? And I love that for me. And the most I loves that for me as well. That's why he's making it possible. So, um, Holy Spirit, ancestors, angels, archangels, and spirit guides that wish to see us walk the highest path for our greatest good. Allow me in the energy. Tell me some stuff I need to know. Give me some insight on what I should focus on. Thank you. Ashe, two of cups. This love, this partnership. Let's see. Thank you, Most High. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Allow me in the energy. Tell me what's going on. Thank you. We have the Four of Cups. Let's see, what about this Four of Cups, Holy Spirit? What about this four cups, Holy Spirit? Tell me about what's going on. Okay, we got the King of Swords. Uh, this King of Swords missed out on an opportunity. Not a single. It's been um, made have taken this person some time to become single with that temperance card at the bottom of the deck. What else, Holy Spirit? Tell me about this King of Swords and his Four of Cups. They're more motivated, confident to gain balance with this Empress. After this deceit and deception and confusion with that moon at the bottom, or maybe after this deceit and confusion was eliminated with the moon at the bottom of the day, I got a message about these thieves that they left out in the cold, or about this thief, singular, could be plural though. Holy Spirit. Thank you. This Emperor gained a new perspective about this lover. All right, the message could be this person, um, somebody was stealing. It had them stuck, hanging hanging upside down. Caused them to gain a new perspective. This emperor, about these about this lover. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Yeah, they released these people from their past. People from their past have been released. You've been released. Yeah, because the Seven of Cups, they see the big picture now. They see the smoke that was being burned in their face. They see the lies and deceit. It's 
Five of Wands, I'm poking through the deck. Hand is itchy. Um, yeah, this competition, the these people might want to, these people may be fighting with this emperor now, or they were fighting. Um, this competition with whatever new relationship is coming in with this emperor and this empress. Holy Spirit. Okay, so um, <laughs> this emperor had people from their past that they released, right? Because they were always arguing, they were always in some sort of kerfuffle, all right? And it is because of this motion that these people from their past had um, that they were trying to set in place, it has come to an ending. And balance is now here with the Six of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Holy Spirit, thank you so much for your presence. I can feel you. Thank you so much. I love you. Yeah, because this person is selling into karma waters. Or this energy wants to sell into karma waters. This divine masculine. After ending something, because we know every ending is a new beginning. And their new beginning is sailing into karma waters. I'm hearing um, white flag. After this person has uh, been betrayed, stabbed in their back by this group of people. didn't jump out. It didn't jump out. <laughs> I know it didn't jump out either. We have a base. Okay, so this person is sailing into karma waters because they had a breakthrough. They overcame hardship and um, and failure. They they have severed ties. Okay. They ended a romantic relationship. They overcame this. They overcame this hardship within uh, a romantic relationship. They severed ties with them. We got the hermit. I mean, we have the nine of pentacles as well. Oh, and now they could be sitting pretty. They could be sitting pretty. They could be um, receiving 
abundance and prosperity, wisdom, confirmation with that. Because we have the hermit at the bottom of the deck. So this person has gained a lot of wisdom, a lot of knowledge, a lot of understanding. What else, Holy Spirit? got a double jumping out with the seven of wands so this person is defending themselves or defending the life that they're trying to create for themselves yeah they are defend or they could be could be um no they could just be um obsessed why are you so obsessed with me they could be uh, addicted Oh, okay. So this person who has overcome this romantic energy, this, I mean, they, they let go of this romantic relationship, right? Because it was low vibrational. It was um, the devil, so to speak. Uh, and they, they're defending themselves and they're also defending this lover. It's taken them some time, but they are waiting on new ships to, to come in because they had a spiritual awakening or they received some spiritual advice. Now they wanna come in with a message um, of love or uh, of emotion, which is not something that they have much experience with. They are a lover a charmer, um, a little childish. Um, no, I shouldn't say childish, but the emotionally immature. I'm just gonna say disattached from their emotions. And now they wanna bring in this, now they wanna bring in a message, a gift, a peace treaty. In, 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 uh, change their life for the better, better. Yeah, confirmation, sun car jumping out. <clears throat> this message that they received from this queen of swords, upright, broke their heart that allowed them to see this message about betrayal and deception broke their heart but it allowed them to see truth and the smoke being blown in their face and the options that they had now they're able to read between the lines what else Holy Spirit to see that this energy was ungrounded, corrupt, and 
unfaithful, unloving, unsupportive. And justice is here. And they left this person out in the cold. That five of pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Anything else, Holy Spirit? Anything else, Holy Spirit? Yeah, this person is now working on themselves. Okay, let's do one more. Okay. Let's see, we have the chariot at the bottom of the deck. Let's see, what's going on in this area? Okay, we have the two of swords. So someone blocked out the outside world and gained balance of their mind and emotions, guarding guarding their heart. <clears throat> they want new relationship, new emotional uh, partnership, new emotional connections after being isolated, bound, blinded, and um, stuck. They felt like they were stuck. They have found balance, no longer juggling, emotional fulfillment is here, happiness is here, happily ever after is here, and they are defending it, yes, because the, this, this balance has um, brought more confidence and more motivation to this King of Wands. Thank you so much for your love and they're defending their happiness they gain wisdom and knowledge about self in the outside world they secluded themselves they stopped partying as much stopped drinking as much stop clubbing stop i'm hearing stop again as much What else, Holy Spirit? So yeah, this person is defending their happiness. You're the Empress. Holy Spirit, please tell me, is this upright or in reverse? Reverse. Upright or in reverse? Upright or in reverse? In reverse. Okay, they get the Empress in reverse. They're moving ahead, they're moving away. They're advancing past this Empress in the reverse. Someone who's blocked, smothering. They lack love. They're negligent. <sighs> Excuse me. The other person is moving forward away from this energy. That chariot card. We're smothering that part. Smothering this energy into... Um, Isolation. Yeah, this message 